Hello friends, I'm Dr. Vinod Kumar and here comes my next video. I've made this video on the topic called Secret to Become Rich. In order to deliver this presentation, I've taken the reference of our Honorable Chairman and Managing Director of Reliance Industries Limited, Mr. Mukesh Maniji. As per economic times, Mr. Mukesh Ambani continues to be the richest Indian for the seventh year. He is running with a wealth of rupees 3.7 lakh crores of rupees, which means if we take a risk free return of only 10% per annum, then becomes 10% of 3.7 lakh crore means 37,000 crore per annum which is risk-free I have talked about. Let us divide now 37,000 crore by 12. It becomes 3,083 crore approximately per month, which is again risk-free. Let us divide 3,083 crore by 30 or 31. It becomes 100 crore approximately per day, risk-free. If we increase the return with risk, by 30% then it becomes 300 crore per day. That is exactly what Economic Times mentioned in their article of Rich List in India dated 25th of September 2018. That over the last year Ambani wealth increased by rupees 300 crore per day which means Increase without any risk is 100 crore and with working through risk it is 300 crores per day. This is what is being informed by Economic Times and the data has already been given which is more than the population of India that is 130 crore approximately and if you compare 300 crore per day wealth increase with 130 crore population of India then what our Honorable CMD Mr. Mukesh Ambani can do for the people of our country, we cannot even imagine. Mr. Ambani can create wonders and we are proud of him. Here are some other facts shared by Economic Times in terms of wealth of rich persons in India. Let us view one by one with the images of these facts, with the business tycoons and the capital they hold. Let us take a look. Mr. Mukesh Ambani, 3,71,000 crore. SP Hinduja and family, 1,59,000 crore. LN Mittal and family, 1,14,000 crore. As you can see in the list, this is the list I have taken from Economic Times. These are the facts which are being shared by Economic Times in terms of the wealth of rich persons in India. Aziz Premji, 96,000 crore. Dilip Shangvi, 89,000 crore. Uday Kotak, 78,000 crore. As you can see again in the list. Now coming to Cyrus S. Punavala, that is 73,000 crores of capital. Gautam Adani and family, 71,000 crore. Cyrus Palonji Mistri, 69,000 crore. Shapurji Palonji Mistri, again 69,000 crore. Coming back to our topic, that is secret to become rich. The secret is to improve your width of organization in terms of number of product lines, in terms of subsidiaries, categories, brands, variants, strategic alliances, joint ventures, number of plants, entering multiple markets, entering multiple countries, multiple segments, multiple areas, etc 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 it means improving your width will improve your wealth let us try to understand the width concept through reliance portfolio the reliance is a parent company to 84 indian and 42 foreign subsidiaries which means a total of 124 subsidiaries having multiple categories product lines brands and variants Reliance also has 25 India and 7 foreign companies 
as associates and 20 Indian and 5 foreign companies as joint ventures, which means a total of 57 subsidiaries in the form of association and joint ventures collectively. Let us add 124 subsidiaries with 57 alliances. The total width of Reliance Industries Limited is 181, including domestic and international scale. 181 subsidiaries with multiple product lines, categories, brands, variants for multiple segments and countries. You can imagine what could be the turnover of Reliance. This is what I am calling the width of Reliance as a conglomerate. That is what the secret that I am sharing with the help of this presentation. This is the secret one has to learn. This improvement in width is the only secret to become rich. Higher the width, higher the revenue, higher the profit, higher the value of shares, higher the market, higher the employment, etc. etc. But only those people will become rich who have the guts and risk-taking ability to take their organizations to higher level of wealth. Knowing the secret will not make you rich, but implementing the secret will actually make you rich. Now you can make a self-analysis whether you have the ability to take this challenge in the form of entrepreneurship or you have the employee attitude. Choice is yours. It entirely depends upon the vision and goals you have set for your life. There are people who are fine with one organization as employee and there are people who have the vision to take their enterprise to high level of width as sky is the limit. Think about it and choice is yours. But be comfortable with whatever you choose. That is only the secret of happiness. With this, I would like to end this topic. Stay healthy and stay wealthy. Thank you very, very much and have a nice day ahead.